I think he's been hurt, and I think somebody knows what happened, you know, and uh, I hope that they'll come forward and say something. A father in BB not giving up on finding his son who's been missing for almost eight months. 34-year-old Nathan Allen was last seen at the Economy Inn on West DeWitt Henry Drive in BB back on June 29th. Fox 16's Rochelle Turner spoke to Nathan's father about the disappearance. What did he tell you, Rochelle? Well, Donna Kevin, good afternoon to you. Lee Allen says it's tough not knowing what happened to his son. The family put up these signs all around BB, and they've spent countless days searching for Nathan. He's 6'4 and uh, about 340 pounds. Lee Allen tells us about his son Nathan through this flyer. He was a good guy. He, he was big. Uh, everybody liked him. The 34-year-old has been missing since June 29th of 2019. Well, I feel depressed and uh, uh, loss of hope, you know, and uh, of him being alive. BB police say Nathan was last seen at this economy inn. There's where it started. That's what happened. I think something happened to him right here. Allen says Nathan had a home and a job and wonders why he was at the motel. I got a call from uh, his uh, girlfriend and uh, she told me that his truck was down here at the economy inn and been sitting down here for a week. Since June, he searched the woods in different places around town. Nothing turns up. There's no clues. Nothing happened. You know, no cell phone, no, no trace of any kind. And it's just... Uh, it's just hard to uh, to go on like that. He says something's not right about Nathan's disappearance, and he's not stopping until he has answers. At this point, I don't expect to hear anything good, you know, because if something good would have come up, he would have showed up by now. Now, Allen says Nathan has a distinctive tattoo on his right forearm, and he's meeting with detectives tomorrow morning. I reached out to BB Police, who told me the investigation is ongoing, and they're doing all they can to locate him. Back to you. All right, Rochelle.